Meanwhile, in Polk County, one of Florida's largest school districts is struggling to fill teaching positions. And with the first day of school next week, ABC Action News reporter Rebecca Petit looks into what Polk County schools are doing to get teachers in the classroom. It's very concerning. Um, the amount of teachers that are quitting, uh, the amount of teachers that are consistently working for looking for other jobs. Octavio Hernandez teaches algebra at Citrus Ridge Academy. He tells me the pandemic has led some educators to rethink their work. Teachers are seeing um, so many mental issues with students as well that it has become very overwhelming. Um, I myself have had over six students um, that have been Baker acted. He says the stress of the job and a lack of pay has also contributed to the teacher shortage in Polk County Public Schools. The district currently has 162 teaching positions open. Hernandez is concerned fewer teachers will mean larger class sizes. Class sizes is, is perhaps the, the biggest variable that we have to student success. You have smaller class sizes it's easier for a teacher to do one on one interaction. The district has been holding virtual job fairs every other week to recruit teachers. Also bringing in a cultural exchange program where we're getting about 70 teachers who are certified with teaching experience from other countries, uh, specifically the Philippines, Jamaica, India. Hernandez believes higher pay is needed to recruit and retain teachers. Almost every teacher I know has a second job. Another virtual job fair is set for August 11th. Rebecca Petit, ABC. See Action News.